you know, I get a, I get a text and it's just like, okay, we're going to clear the hallway and we're going to come get you. And we're just going to put you in triple H's office. And like, okay. So <laughs> I run through the building. So like, you know, maybe Hoodie on maybe, and maybe, got you yeah, wrapped like, up yeah. like Michael Jackson's yep. son. Yep. <laughs> They put me in the freight elevator, and it's funny because I know the building like the back of my hand. I'm like, the stairs are right around the corner. Yeah. I could just walk down the stairs. They put me in the freight elevator. Yeah. Okay. Freight elevator lowers. I hear him on the other side of the elevator they're screaming and yelling, clear the hallway, clear the hallway. And I'm like, oh, no. Like, yeah. I'm that guy now. All the boys are going to be like, ah, oh, this is stable. Why do we have to, you know? But they, they clear the hallway, oh, no. and the freight elevator door opens up, and hit, like six steps this way is the door I'm walking into. And I walk in there, and I just sit down, and then I'm just in there. And they're starting the War Games match, okay. right? So it's literally like, yeah. I don't have a deal yet. Mm-hmm. You know, we're at the end of the show. Yeah. So I'm just sitting in there, and the lawyers are going back and forth, you know, hammering stuff out. And uh, Triple H walks in, and he's just like, "If if this gets done, you know, we're just gonna wait. You know, when the time's right, we're gonna bring you in through Gorilla." And I was like, "Okay, great." So contracts get executed, and it's time. And it's literally just like, "Okay, deep breath." Open the door, walk through Gorilla, and now I'm. It's like there's so many people in Gorilla. Yeah. Can I ask you, who was the first person you saw? Like, do you remember the first person you made eye contact with, and they were like, "What the?" Yeah, right. Because I got brought into Gorilla, and I don't think people knew. I think people were just piled in there because it's the end of the show, and there's social media people who are going to be filming. Yeah you know, winners and losers coming through the curtain and they're, they're, they're doing their job and stuff like that. And, uh, I remember being a gorilla and then all of a sudden I get bear hugged from behind. And like, as I kind of turn around to see who it is, it's Bailey. Standard. Uh, and Bailey. she's like, I f- knew it. <laughs> yeah. She's like, as soon as they started yelling at us to clear the hallway, she's yeah. like, I knew it. Yeah. And she's not letting go of me. And then like, you know, the triple H is there. You know, it's like uh, Bailey, let him go. No. Stephanie, I remember seeing and having a moment with. You know, there's somebody I haven't seen in ten years. Yeah. Right. You know what I mean? There's somebody that you know. People are like, oh, they hate each other. Yeah. It, it, you know, it, uh, <laughs> Regal. I remember looking at Regal and Regal <laughs> going, <laughs> <laughs> "Look at us, yeah, like, yeah, that, yeah, like yeah, that, like yeah, that, yeah, like that Paul Rudd video. Look at us, look at us, look at us, look at us. You know, and, but there was just so many people in there. It was like. And and then I don't I don't know what to do. I absolutely lose my composure. Yeah. Cause all I know is I'm coming out. Yeah. But I don't I don't I, I I don't know what the set looks like. I don't know if there's a ramp. I'm literally like in the dark. Walking in blind. And so I'm 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 trying to talk to Triple H over the table. You know, and I'm and but and it's so loud, and there's so many people, and they like hit my music, and I'm like, I don't know what I'm doing. Yeah. <laughs> what am I doing? Look cool, look cool. And look he's cool. like, and he's like, go out and walk, walk down the, the, to the cage, and I'm like, go out and walk all the way down to the cage. <laughs> That's crazy. And he was trying to tell me that there was two cages for the baby faces oh, and the heels for the war games, yeah. and he wanted me to walk down and stand in between there. And so in my head, up. I'm like, I'm marching all the way all to the cage. Yeah, right. And he's like, no, and my music's playing, yeah. and, he, and you're like, we're going back and forth, and I'm like. I mean, we're both freaking out. <laughs> like, no. And like he rips his headset off and I'm like, oh God, yeah. what are we doing? Uh-huh. You know, and we've obviously we figured it out, but <laughs> that's the amazing. Place, I'll never look at that the same right? again. <laughs> yeah, the chaos backstage, brother. I mean it's the last minute. Last, I'm Someone's last minute gotta away. have this on film too. You know? <laughs> there is there is so much stuff going on back yeah. there, and they film everything now. So I'm I'm sure someday we're gonna yeah. see a lot of cool stuff. You're you're like, next. Hey, it was just hey, such geez. a it was just such a great moment. And I, I love that chaos and that uncertainty again. I was like, man, I could just drink it up all day. Catch the Rich Eisen Show every single day on the Roku channel, 12 to 3 Eastern for free.